diary. Today is a very exciting day. I'm gonna get my very own first pet. Well, technically, I've had pets before. Like right now, we have a family dog. And we have a family cat. But see, I don't have my own pet. And finally, my mum said yes to me getting my very own one. Well, I mean, she said yes after lots of persuasion. Please, 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 please. If I say yes, will you leave me alone? Well, I mean, I think that counts as a yes. I'm not sure which pet we're getting yet. Maybe a bunny, but then I heard bunnies are really hard to take care of. They're not as easy as you think. Or maybe a guinea pig. That would be cool. I've never had one before. I mean, I guess we'll see what there is at the pet store. As long as I get my own pet, then I'm happy. Come on, Phoebe. Let's go before I change my mind. Oh, that's my mum. Okay, I'll speak to you when I'm back with my new pet diary. Bye! Hi, mum! Okay, are you sure you're ready for your own pet? It's a big responsibility. Yes, I'm all ready. I'm going to be the best pet owner ever. All right, then. Let's get in the car and go before the shop closes. OK, let's go get a new pet. Here we are. I can't wait to find my new pet. I'm so excited. Hi, welcome to our pet shop. Are you looking for pet supplies today or are you looking to adopt? Hi. Hi, my daughter here is looking to get her first pet. Wonderful. We have four pets up for adoption today. Have a look at each one uh, and let me know what you think. Thank you. <gasps> Mum, look. It's a bird. Wow. Birds are so pretty and I love how they sing in the morning. Thinking of getting a pet bird? Birds are amazing pets. But you must know that they wake up early and can make lots of noise. Also, some birds can live for longer than 50 years in some cases, so you'll have to look after them forever. That's a very big responsibility, Phoebe. Oh, well, yeah, maybe that's too big a responsibility. Look, Phoebe, a frog. Oh, hi, froggy. Frogs may be small, but they're definitely a big commitment if you decide to welcome one into your home. Many have a lifespan of around 15 years and need very specific care and attention in order for them to stay healthy. Frogs are also not fond of being picked up or held. They make excellent pets for kids who want to care for a pet, not cuddle with one. Also, they're nocturnal, so they'll only be active at night. Oh, but that means I won't be able to spend time with him. I'll be sleeping when he's awake. Yes, and you do need your sleep for school. Let's see what else there is. Oh, <gasps> Mum, look! A butterfly! Oh, I love butterflies. They're so pretty. I always have them outside my bedroom window, too. This is our pretty butterfly. It used to be a caterpillar, and then it transformed into a butterfly. The only sad thing about butterflies is that they don't tend to live very long. Most adult butterflies live only one or two weeks on average. That's not very long at all. We might have to bury it by the time we take it home. Mum, that's so sad, poor butterfly. Don't worry. This butterfly is going to live its best life. I was thinking of releasing it and letting it be free to spend its two weeks wherever it wants. That's a wonderful idea, see, honey. This butterfly is going to live its best life. Well, that's good. I hope you have the best life ever, butterfly. Well, it looks like we might not find a pet for you today, pumpkin. Sorry about that. Oh, but I really want you to pet today. Actually, we do have one more to show you. Really? Yes, this is our hamster. These little guys are great starter pets. Oh, <gasps> Mum, look! It's so cute! It's eating its food! Oh my gosh, and it's so tiny and fluffy. Hamsters can be very friendly once they get used to you. 
You'll need to carefully take your time in order to help them feel safe and familiar when being handled. In general, hamsters tend to live for around two to three years. Oh, they're so cute. Oh, please, Mum. Please, can I have a hamster, please? It looks like we'll be taking the hamster then. <gasps> Yay! Perfect. I'll just prepare him for you. In the meantime, you can purchase some hamster food and cages from us. Come on then, Phoebe. Let's get everything we need for the hamster. Okay, so we will need a cage, water bottle, food bowl, food and some toys. I'll just need you to sign a few documents before he's yours. Yes, okay. Let me just sign here and there. Here you go. He's all ready. I've placed him in this box so you can safely take him home. Thank you so much. Thank you. You're welcome. Make sure you take good care of him. I'm always here if you need any help or have any questions. Thank you so much. Bye now. Bye. Have a great day. Bye. Come on, Mr. Hamster. Let's get you home. Okay, come on. Let's get you inside. Here we go, little guy. Home sweet home. Let me just make some space for you. I'll put you on top of my dresser. But first, let me take some of this stuff off. Okay, perfect. Now, let's put you in your new cage. Hope you like your new cage, Mr. Hamster. Me and you are going to be the best of buddies. Oh, I'm so happy I finally got my own pet. How's it going? Hey, Mom. We're best friends already. That's great to hear. Have we thought of a name yet? Um, I'm not sure what to call him. I might have to ask my friends to help me. We'll make sure you think of a name soon. Calling a hamster Mr. Hamster isn't very original. I will. Okay, I'll leave you two to it. Bye, honey. Bye, Mom. I hope you'll be happy here, little guy. We're going to have the best time together, and I promise I'm going to be the best owner to you.